Hey guys, Sackman and Show 3 here, and today I am back with another World Box video. I know it's been a while since I've recorded and also made World Box videos. And I just want to say that I haven't really been into the uh, gaming industry for a while, and also I've been quite busy with my life. Just haven't had time or the interest. But I am back today, and I've gotten back into World Box, and a lot has changed. And so today, I just want to revisit this on my channel and make a small little story. I don't think it's going to end up as a series, but hey, if you guys really like it, maybe so. So I'm going to just let this play out. I'm going to play God, so I will interact with the world a little bit. Maybe say some things weren't me, but they were just natural, you know. I don't know, we will see how things play out. So right here we got our fair share of biomes. It's looking like we got some biome wars going on here where they're trying to take each other over. Um, so yeah, this world is slowly growing into its full masterpiece form. But... Who really knows where it's going to end up? I mean, especially when we got these nations that I'm going to start adding, the species. I I still, I don't think um, kingdoms can, but I really wish they'd be able to, like, launch bombs so we're not the only ones that can use them. That'd be pretty sick. All right, so since they need boats to cross islands, I'm thinking that you're going to have to add them in the water and see where they end up. So you're going to add two of each species, preferably male and female, but hey, who knows? Hopefully they don't kill each other off the bat, if you know what I mean. Maybe we'll give all of these guys a trait that is peaceful. Um, okay, just to start these guys off, where's peaceful at? Oh, what does it look like? Um, Dang, I can really not remember. Okay, um... Hmm. I guess I just gotta go through here. Until I find it. Wait, oh, oh, there it is. It's... <laughs> that's what it was. Okay. We don't want you guys to attract each other. Your children, possibly. But you guys... No, you all have the touch of God. You are the first ever to exist. Um, did we want to give them anything else just for being the first ever? I mean, their traits won't fully pass off, but their first children will be nice. I don't really want to make them immortal. You know? But... Maybe. Alright. What we're going to do is a little Adam and Eve thing. This is what the species is supposed to be like. We're supposed to have a peaceful world. We'll see where this ends up. They're very strong-minded. They're peaceful. They can heal each other. They're blessed by God. And I don't want to make them immortal, but we will make them immune. We'll see how far that goes. All right. And with that, I will shower these traits onto them and we will begin to see where they go. All right, so they all go to the main island here, it seems. All right, so they're all <laughs> they're all taking the mainland here. All right, so it seems we've got a lot of kingdoms so far. Okay, right off the bat, Oh, what happened to that? Oh, okay. Right off the bat, we got seven kingdoms. That's very interesting. 
Um, there is one thing. All right, that's turned on. Good, good, good. I really wanted to see for a few minutes. It's been there for a while. I do apologize if any of the sounds in the background are too loud. Okay, already ravaged. Was it by these shiny creatures? The Rack Grocks? What? Whatever they are called. You can't spawn these creatures, I don't think. Yeah, that's something they needed to do, is allow you to spawn these biome-specific creatures. It would be nice. Alright, so it seems right here we got a little orc. Yeah, alright, so we got this little orc thing been going on here. Very nice. Ooh, that's not good for their forest. Um, it does appear, though, that they are all stuck on this main island. This is going to be very bad. This is looking like ancient China. It's, it's all apart. It's looking like the states everything it needs to combine at some point and i know that's going to happen i just you know what they should do is have kingdoms with like combined species you know what i mean so it doesn't matter they can just be combined species um and if that is a thing i didn't know about that <laughs> but it is really interesting they should do that all right let's see what some of these people got so it seems like peaceful trade has passed down Okay, so you are one of the original. Very nice. You've got the minor trait. That is also because you are. That's just what you naturally get. Okay, so we do got this little lava inferno. I forgot what it's called. Unfortunately, though, whoever was living here. Oh, snap. What just happened here? New kings are being... Alright, so it seems these three have kings. Okay. So this one already has an army, a king, a prince, and they've got a separate village. They are actually doing very well. They are separate from them. They can explore all of this. All of this. We still got all the rest of this to explore. It's pretty crazy. Um... But right now, I guess they all like being a part of the same species or the same island, I guess. Um, this one's not doing very well. It's just you. Not reproducing. This one's doing very well with their boats. Already having a dock trading about, but. Are they ready to explore? Will they expand their kingdom? Looks like all of them so far have already gotten their docks up. That's great. All right. All right. So let's take a look here. Nice villages. All right. So many kingdoms here. It looks like mainly the elves and the dwarves but i'm going to have to say since this one's just one guy that the <laughs> they don't even have a king i mean that's basically what he is it's a king um elves are definitely the winning species at this point but also i can't really say that for sure because the orc here has the most land. Well, all together. No, still. Yeah, pretty nice. Um, let's check the cultures here. So, looks like they're all separate cultures as well. Interesting. All right. So, hmm. Mainly, all right, they're trying to work on the sword, working on the sword. Okay, 
so it's looking like the elves are definitely quite in the lead, but I don't know. I can't really say that. I guess we'll have to still find out. They really are just sticking to their mainland right now, which is a little boring, but I guess we'll see where that goes from here. Hmm. It seems like nobody is at war with anyone. They've all come to peace. This guy, this guy just needs to learn at this point. Oh, okay. Did he just join them or, or what happened? He just got destroyed there. Okay. That kingdom's gone. So it looks like, oh, deceitful. Sorry guys, that's something my eye felt like. Um, it is quite late for me, so my eyes are a bit itchy. Oh, come on, let me click on you. No trades, sad. Oh, where did that hit? Did we see where that hit? Was it right here? No, they're expanding. Okay, so they've got that there. Didn't seem to be on the main landing there. I cannot seem to find where that landed oh no was it here because <laughs> there'd be no way I'd be able to tell I mean it's yeah so this is very peculiar this biome is just starting up out of nowhere very interesting all right let's see what you have we want to make you a giant evil Um, you just want to kill everything. Let's see where that goes. Oh, snap. Oh, he was killed. All right. So if we make, all right, so this person there oh moods really sad why is that so interesting okay favorite food <laughs> i wonder if i can make you strong mad i just want to see if this person will be undefeatable Venomous. We'll see what they do now. Does that mean they'll blow things up? Don't want to test that out. So this person, don't know where they... All right, well... Most kingdoms seem to be doing great. All right, let's see if there's anywhere in the debug menu. Oh, come on. <laughs> so funny trying to hit all these. It might spiral away from you. Okay. Put on sonic speed here. We'll see how fast time goes. New village. Okay. See, they are spreading. Very nice. Where was that at? Over here? Yeah, it must be. All right. Let's see something interesting. 
still at a volcano in the middle of the ocean here. Let's to make a new island. Dang. Okay, so... That's crazy. All right, there we go. Expeditions to other islands has finally commenced. They have their second island. They have their second one. Oh, 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 snap. They're taking over this whole continent here in there. Were they just having a rebellion? Oh, okay. They just lost, I guess. They wanted to rebel. Uh, th this is literally taking over the whole continent. They're so powerful. There's no way to stop them. That's crazy. Look at these boats. Look at that boat. Wow. Kingdom. Uzord. Uzord. Uzord is what I'll call it. So now that they've spread out, besides them being on this small island here, Hopefully war doesn't commence here. They can definitely start getting more land like them. They've got this whole continent to themselves. Like, that's nuts. If they spread and they spread, it's looking like they might be... Or M might be... Is that the name of the kingdom? I'm trying to look it up. Uh, Gigal Kingdom? They might be in loss if they don't get out of here soon. Oh, all right. What's going on here? Who's your enemy? So you're fighting who now? Okay. All right. So you two are working together to stop them from... Taking independence, maybe? They didn't look like independence, though. They didn't claim independence. Okay, they are really spreading out there. That's insane. This kingdom's got it all. This kingdom's got it all. That's crazy. Would you look at that? Okay, so that's gone. And now it's just them trying to take it over. But their kingdom lives on over here. So they're at war with this whole kingdom? You're at war with them and you're at war with them. Wait a minute. What? Dang. Alright, so they took over this whole continent. Not very beneficial for them, though. I'd still have to say now... If I take a good look at these charts again, um, all right. I mean, the definitely the orcs, definitely the orcs. Ooze Ord, amazing what they've got. I mean, there's just no stopping them, obviously. Humans coming in a semi close second, but um, the elves at the beginning, I said they were pretty good. They do got two kingdoms, but they. Not doing too well otherwise. Okay. Okay, what well, what happened here? Two independences. Very interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Wow. When did this happen? So, are they having an independence war right now? So, who is this? Did they also spread apart? Okay, they're taking over. They are back to normal. It seems like, all right, they might be losing this war. All right, so that civil war is gone. Anybody that tried to go away, yep. All right, so that's attack. Looks like the Purple is going to be getting that land. Looks like they're infiltrating and taking less resources. All right. Um, what's going on?
going on over here though? Who's who's fighting who now? Because we just demolished all of this. Wow. Wow. Why are they over here? It's because they attacked this. They are strong. Oh my gosh. They just demolished an entire continent. Are they going to start claiming more cities over here? Oh my gosh, no way. That's nuts. So they took this advantage to come over here. Looks like they're not at war with anybody. They're not at war with anybody, but they have came all the way over here. Looks like pink has taken this. Um, Red and gray is at war. Okay, so they are in an alliance. Interesting. Now they are at war with them. They are... Okay, so it looks like Cyan was trying to take these over. Blue? What is going on? So many different... So many different countries trying to rise up. They're still here. This... They're still here. Wow. Alright, so... This is gone. Alright. Um... Looks like they're taking over... Oh, what is going on here? So blue's taken over the bottom half. It looks like gray's moved over here. Red is hanging on just a little bit longer. Blue is trying to take over this continent. Cyan has moved over here so they didn't have to fight anymore. They're currently trying to take over any of the gray left. Looks like Cyan is pretty powerful on this end. Looks like they're going to be hanging on there. Wow. That is crazy. Cyan. Okay, so there's definitely a big war going on here. Um, why are you guys fighting? What is going on here? So many civil wars. So, now they're fighting. Oh my gosh, they totally demolished their town over here obliterating it these are their two long lasting why are you guys fighting the gray are you telling me these are two different grays hold on when did this kingdom arise this is the ooze ord it's literally hanging on for its last life it was so powerful wow ooze ord is gone Wow. Okay, so uh, most of these... Okay, now pink is gone. I'd have to say they're all orc. So orc is inevitably the strongest species and race in world box because they've taken over all, all of this planet. All humans, elves, and dwarves went extinct because of the orcs the orcs rule the world at this point but we'll see do they eventually come to peace or will they have a one world order what will happen will they all obliterate each other it seems like there's another civil war going on here that didn't work out oh they're trying again or no it's just Grays. I don't really like this guy. He looks the same. Alright, so I'm going to turn on kingdoms here. Okay, so this is one kingdom. He's at war with the other one. You're at war with Cyan, too. Cyan has taken over this. Now there's an orange kingdom. Okay, what is this one? A light blue. Why would the light blue be trying to do anything? They, they don't seem like they're going to be winning this. No. So. Hmm. Seems like. Alright, so Cyan is fighting orange right now. And everybody, basically, except for this one gray here, who is not fighting anyone. 
Blue is fighting just Cyan at the moment. And this Gray is fighting them. So they are the world superpower. They have over a thousand. That's crazy. They almost have 2,000. But they're also, they're going up exponentially, but they're losing a lot of people due to this war. Will they make it out? Will the cook, the Kukat warriors, I'm assuming, that's how you say that, will they be? The Ooze Ord, what is still here? How did they survive? They are about to surpass them. They were so powerful earlier on. How are they back? I thought they were gone. Okay. I am so very confused, but hey. So, the Redus, um, they're holding onto their ground fairly well. Looks like the Ooze Ord is fighting uh, the Redus and the Kakut Warriors. All right, so they've got a main portion of everything. Seems like they're at peace right now. There's so many boats going everywhere. Like, <laughs> that's nuts. Okay. Um. All right. Looks like Cyan and Blue have taken over most of the continents. Um, Ooze Ord is holding on, but. They're slowly dwindling. It looks like the red agog over here is um, they're steady right now. They're very peaceful, it seems. Okay, wh where did this come from? Those horde is, is gone finally. Will it come back somewhere? Oh, there's necromancers. The Ooze as clan. Where did you come from? So this is must be the left what was left of the blue. They must have changed into a new political group here. Um okay, so cultures wise all of these are the same culture. But there only seems to be one culture. Level fifty nine. So many people are following it. Oh my god. Weaponsmith, Fortification, Ancestral Knowledge. Wow. They've gone pretty far, I'd have to say. They don't even need to learn anything else. So this is like the main world culture. It seems like they're, they're all following one culture because it's the most advanced. Is that a bomb? Or was that from a meteorite? Because if that was a bomb, very cool. If they don't do that, that sucks. But yeah, that's very interesting. But yes, we still do got all of these different towns and these kingdoms going on here. All right, so the Kakot Warriors, despite them losing a lot, they are going up. I think so. Maybe they're going back down. The Ooze as clan is losing in a battle. The bloody cap. Wherever they came from. And then we got Erg. But so far, it looks like the Kukakwap. <laughs> the Kukat Warriors is winning. Green Top Oz. They're holding on. They're not going to make it. I don't believe so. What will they do? Alright, it seems like they're still at war. Okay. Nothing much is happening, but they're not ravaging. Okay, so they just turned them back. Um, guard car. Urgord. <laughs> Strong Dazord. There's so ma many things going on right now. So, are they at war with anybody? No. They are at peace. What is going on over here? So many different kingdoms. All right, so they are at war with just one. I don't know if they're going to last, though. 
It's not even telling me how many people they got. Oh, that's the Uzes clan. Okay. All right. Never mind. They should be fine. But um. They are launching missiles, aren't they? Is that what that sound is? Or is that just for each of these things? Wow. There are King Slayers out there, guys. King Slayers. So, the Dizdiz Axes. <laughs> they are now the world leading population. Where did they come from? Is that the Kakat clan? Kingdom, whatever they were. All right, so I guess we'll see. They. All right, so it's looking like they're at war with them, but I think the clan of Azus is going to lose. They might take. They might take this, but I don't know for sure. I do know. Okay, yeah, they're not going to make it. So they're steady. The Redagog is very steady. The Axes, they're winning this battle so far. I, yeah, there's no way. There's no way. Azuz is very, very gone right there. Yep, Azuz is gone. So, I think we have world peace. There is a little battle going on there. So, Uzez axes are world leading right now oh tap tap and ez why did you guys decide to split apart and what are you fighting oh <laughs> let's go let's go where's he at where's he at where's greg i've been trying to get greg to spawn that's amazing i guess i just caused horror because this is just how humanity works i mean it's not humanity it's just a species but i don't even have eternal lava on me is it still going let me check let me check no no that's very strange yeah very oh wow okay so right now it's looking like Axes is losing a bit of power. Agog has just been sitting on this tiny island. Their people has not been going up, but they've been steadily living a nice, peaceful life. Let's see. The savages, but they haven't even gone to war yet. All right, so one of their lighthouses here has been destroyed at some point. I don't know if that's actually theirs or from the previous they got a statue of dragons. I haven't even spawned three dragons, but I guess they've seen them. A lot of wise men. Oh. Adored Horde. The Axes is still up there, but they're kind of going down. And Ooze as They're... I don't know. Alright, so... The Greener Gorg is... A Gord... I don't think they're getting any farther here. Well, it looks like they are a bit strong. In fact, but... Yeah. Look, okay, yeah, they're gone. They lost the war. Yet again, it is just these two nations. But they're not at war with each other because they're both so very strong. There's so many little battles going on over here. I don't know what is up with that. Unless it's with some species. So what biome is this? They got a statue of a biome. Hmm. This is like a Halloween one? Is that a thing? Um. Corrupt. Yeah, okay, so that's what they're in. That makes sense. All right, so I wonder what blessings we can give people. The Gurk deck, what? The Green Rid, so many, so many, so many um, rebellions, I should say. 
It's crazy. The axes. Oh no. Are they going to lose? That's crazy. This might actually happen. Oh snap. Use AUG fighters. So far, guys, all we've been seeing is plain out war. When will they come together? The Red Agog, they've just been here forever. I mean, do we incite war? Are we a loving god or a mischievous god? I think they all deserve the divine light. wonder if you could spawn angels just for being here the great ones that they are but otherwise oh the axe is spawning so looking like the ooze as slowly but surely it's holding on there the gur deck has the population advantage Okay, Green Red just took over so much. Why? So much war. It does not make a lot of sense. So, they've got a lot of allies. But they're just fighting them. It's a very, very difficult and confusing... We could force them all to make peace. All right, so I will get them. Okay. Very interesting. Um, not much is going on here. I guess we just launch a meteorite in the middle of this place. Will they recover from that? Of course they will. Some meteorites do. Do they expect? Wow. <laughs> A lot of people died, but it seems like they're holding on even though this cosmic event, unimaginable stuff, has just happened. Crabzilla would be fun. Maybe we'll hold off on that one. We'll see. Is it going to be snowy? We'll see the mix. I will say we can spawn a flame tower here. And on some of these islands that nobody goes to, spawn an ice one. Maybe. Ton of mages. They'll make their way somehow. Let's see what goes on here. We've got evil skeletons arising from the ground. Will they come together with the skeleton army? How many skeletons can we spawn here? Will they be enough to stop any wars? So right now it's looking like um, bloody dzz. 
is trying to fight on. The Gurgek is currently winning. Oh, the Agog is gone. The Red Oak. Yikes. The Neg God Boys. Wow. See what this does. It's been destroyed immediately. Very interesting. Um, let's see if any of these UFOs here will they attack? Will they solve this world war? They are definitely doing a lot of destruction. So I've yet to see Greg. I wonder if he responds. But if he does not, I don't believe he does. Oh, they're expanding their empire. They are destroyed. <laughs> okay. How long will it take for this biomass to be destroyed? Very quickly. Tumors destroyed immediately. So it's really just these two at war right now, and that comes out of nowhere. Will they be able to defeat these dragons? Maybe. We need to see what they can take. How strong, how strong these creatures are, the orcs. They've taken out everything else. Was it enough for them? Oh, wow. Are the UFOs still here? The red top ooze seems to be taking a big toll on the Pazidas. Um, wow. All right. A lot of oozes. Maybe that's just the uh, orc attack. Small rat. Where's the rat? Very big rat. Yeah. Let's release these things. See what plague they get. Oh wow, they're actually killing people. Um. So. There's going to be a plague, and we'll see if people survive such plague. All right, they're going to be very sick. Will it pass on? Currently, it's just a small percentage of people in this who knows if they'll survive anything that being I don't know any wars okay so that was a big big like split right there okay earthquake looking like however that the plague has done nothing. 
maybe if we expose it to a larger amount of people. We need to throw all these soldiers who will definitely go fight battle. Will they spread the virus? We will see if they have to go to war. I don't know. All right, let's see the current stats on this world. This world has been going on for 1,700 years or so. Um, over 100,000 deaths. And the current population is only 3,000. That's very bad. <laughs> so, I don't know if the plague has even took a big toll on anybody. How big of a population do we need to spread this to? I mean, everybody? I don't want to just kill the whole world. Oh, there you go. Infected. It's going up. The numbers. Where, where are these numbers at? Very interesting. Okay. How do you know what they're infected with? It doesn't really say, does it? Well, the numbers are going down. They probably made a vaccine. <laughs> it's going back up. It could just be from the deaths, too. Um, oh, there was peace made. Okay. I definitely know a lot of it was up in this region. So maybe that's a cause for it. All right, let's see. Any more wars going on here? world peace we have finally achieved the world peace um why was it destroyed what's going on here <laughs> our infected is going down a lot but there's definitely a plague out there and i don't know how long it's going to stay there Definitely want to play with this Crabzilla. Oh my gosh, Crabzilla looks so small. Crabzilla really just lives in the water. But who will he attack today? Who will experience trauma? A boat? Ooh. Very cool explosion. <laughs> now this, this is something to behold. Write this in your history books, kids. Burning. <laughs> this is all going to turn into a wasteland. Shaking is a little bit much. I understand, but it's hurting my eyes. Wow. Maybe they'll make world peace after this. Have fun populating these areas when you can't. I don't know what biome will take over after this. This island should no longer exist. Get out of here, boat. Get out of here. Oh, there you go. It's too late. We will see. What will continue? To live on. Will they repopulate these burnt and destroyed areas? You know what would be really cool is if they had airplanes and they could take you down as Crabzilla. I mean, come on. 
they just need to have an advanced technology like level for their civilization over time but like you can set it to a certain one you can turn off advancements and like world laws i just think it'd be really cool destroy there we go if you haven't had enough already the world is dying you along with it oh i died <laughs> all right so so far it looks like um they're still going to have to repair uh, right now it's just a bunch of fires, but where I've attacked before, they haven't seemed to do much with the ruins. There's still a big population, and that's just because of all of this area. Um, yeah, a lot of the ruins is not being touched, but it does seem like they are okay. They are doing some reconstruction. Very interesting. All right, let's take a look here all the cultures so yet again mainly all part of the same culture and that's just because over time when one culture fits it fits all and they're all going to use it i don't think they're going to stray apart from that if it seems to work the best and has the best knowledge on everything it's just why would you change to anything else i don't know i don't think any new culture is going to arise they're all orcs <laughs> All right, village layer. Definitely a lot of villages here. Hold on, I gotta sneeze here. I think. Maybe not. I can't tell I'm feeling it, guys. <laughs> so there's only one person living in this kingdom here. That's very sad. So who are you? Kingdom of Red Oak. Wow. Oh. Sorry, guys. Hmm. I didn't know I could do this. Oh. That is so very cool. You can have up to 80 kingdoms and no more. Well, that's just <laughs> what they look like now. They, they had a change. All right, so they're still at war. But I'm not seeing any battles take place. Um, what more do they need? The evil snowmen are taking over. Can they withhold the invasion? That is my question. Will the snowman take over? Back that like one of these cold ones. We'll see in time. Don't think they're going to get far though. All right, you guys. A lot of immune. Are you all immune? <laughs> so it seems like. Let me check here. There's still a lot of infected people, but there's so many immune people, and I don't know if it's through the genetics or if it's just because that's a common thing. But that's very interesting. So it looks like <laughs> it looks like evolution is occurring in Worldbox. 
the traits that get passed down that help you survive survival of the fittest natural selection it works in this game and that is so awesome that is so funny so it looks like when all the infected die yep they're not immune Oh, you are immune, but will you survive these attacks in the war? So the plague has definitely gotten, I think, everybody that is not immune. And I don't know, but there's just two people in the world now. I, I just haven't found... Okay, so you haven't been affected. You're not immune, but you haven't been infected very very interesting we'll see who survives though hmm. now i wonder what i should add all right we're gonna see <laughs> What does that mean? Burger heads? <laughs> Show plague infection. Interesting. Okay. Um... So there's all of the... <laughs> Infected people, if I turn this off, those are all the infected. So it has became worldwide, but there are a lot of immune people. So I don't know why they're not dying, though. But it looks like it's mainly clustered in these cities, of course. But Gudo, Tanog, Rareg, um... Rarug, Rid Rid, all, all of these, all of them. <laughs> I don't think any of these people are immune. Can we find one person that doesn't have it or that's immune? And how are you guys still living? Wow, that's just crazy. Okay, you don't got it, and that's very, okay, very weird interesting how are you guys still living the plague should have killed you i don't know <laughs> it's very interesting um hmm. all right so they've all right i've definitely seen a big increase in all these house upgrades and expansions though but okay Tala Tala are you going to do this Red Oak only has seven people what what is Red Oak going to die do these people even have the virus I don't think so are they immune are they all in here is this tell me how many people are in here zero passengers is parked at the moment okay how many people jumped in? None. None. What is going on here? Where is everybody? All right, so I'm going to have to inspect. Well, they all have unlimited now that I added that. Um, but I want to inspect these houses. I guess that's just not a thing. All right, so. Dang, <laughs> more houses destroyed than we got. Death to the plague. Oh my gosh, 1,700. 17,600 people. Total deaths, I, I think that includes this and that. Oh, natural deaths. Okay, I was going to say creatures eaten. All right, yeah, so that all should add up to this. I know, there's infected. Okay, okay. Um. Dang. World population is at seven. Okay, so it's gone up by a lot. 
here's the thing is the total deaths is going up it's <laughs> literally a hundred and thirty thousand there's only one person what the heck just happened what did people just move here okay anybody infected let me see this no infected people on zada it's been renamed to zada no it's still red oak that's just the town what no infected people here they've got a king and everything what is going on none of these people are infected but they're not immune they've just been remote this is quarantine island here is that the king nice i'm gonna give you some flower prints and um i don't know i guess we'll see where that goes that is so very cool how did you raise 231 people oh my they literally made one of me we at least have somebody worshiping their god it's because i don't even know they just feel blessed i mean i did bless them at one point so many infected people though penguins so that's a ruins ancient alien structures all right so that's crazy looks like this war is going on they're at peace but war is definitely going on oh my gosh <laughs> world population is up there that's crazy okay um they don't even have a thousand yet they're almost there come on oh you're going down oh there we go never mind on no all right well i don't even know why there's no battles going on if they're at war but they've definitely have <laughs> they're so blessed there's no virus here there's nobody traveled here that has the virus they they need to have like um Oh, what is it called? Tourists. They need to have people to come tour. All right. Let's see what biomes we can change at random. Let's see which one win. So, definitely massive infection going on here. It hasn't even reached them. But the deaths by it, I do not seem that fatal. I don't know. All right, let's see what Burger Head does. Oh, they don't seem to have a Burger Head. Don't know what that means. Dead units? Ooh. Like ghosts? Or their, their corpses just lay there? Does that mean a dead unit? I think that's what it means. Okay. Um, okay. Wow. Wow. So it's showing them as soon as they die. Then it goes away. After a while. That's a lot of dead units. I think that's due to the plague. It's all over the place. That's definitely the plague. That's why this is dwindling so much. Wow. That's just whack. So it seems like they're not wanting to go to war for some reason. Population total. Where does it show this at? Let's 
Is there any cursed? Okay. Um. So it seems like the only cursed are up here. All right, so this seems to be a genetic trait of some people up here. All right, let's see what other genetics. Anybody with this on them? No, no mushroom. Trunk heads. Farmers. Alright, I'm actually just gonna click off of these. <laughs> um make units <laughs> What? I wanna try this. Okay, I don't know what this is going to do to anything. It's a very bad idea. Oh my gosh, all the boats are coming over here. They're not following me. Oh my gosh. What? Oh my gosh. There's a big battle going on here. <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. All right. Um Wow. That is like everybody I think. Oh my <laughs> Wow. All the boats in the ocean. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh my gosh. What is going on here? They're following in a single file line. What? Oh my gosh. I'm overloading this area. Where did you get the shield from? Is that natural? Oh my. <laughs> There's like so many people over here. That's bizarre. So do they just stay where they were? Or did they move? Oh, snap. Well, that's gone. Um, Are you guys still all good? I don't know what that means. Hmm. All right. Well, it's looking like we got all these boats over here, but now they don't know what to do. Let's see. Are these guys infected? Anybody? They're immune. We got these immune people. How did you guys get immune? Oh, it's only some of them. A lot of these ancient 
things going on. All right, well, unless we get any rebellions, this is what we're going with. And um, what would happen? Everybody got inspiration. Just break away from each other. Are they all at world peace? Man, a lot of infected people up here. This whole region. Um, I'm going to click on that again. Where is it at? There you go. Wow. Oh, never mind. That's just the color of the kingdom. I was going to be like... So, right, that's a lot. Satellite mode. Normal mode. Definitely though, up in this region, it's very dense, you can tell, but more spread out in these regions. I see any down here? Oh yeah, they're actually infected now. Let's see who wins. I'm not sure what to do anymore. <laughs> Will we be last down to the last people? Wow. To the last people living here. <laughs> Look at this. It's all ruins. So many ruins. How many of it? That's insane. All right, guys. Well, I think personally that I have had a long video so far. So I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If there's anything else you guys want to see me do on this channel, just let me know. Recommend anything to me. I will think about it. I don't always have time. I don't always have the interest, but I will check it out and maybe I will play it for you guys. If you guys want to see any more world box, let me know any ideas you want me to do with world box or any other game like Minecraft, some challenges you want me to try some stories. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, just let me, let me know in the comments down below. And uh, if you like to make sure to hit like and subscribe, if you want to see more content like this, and I'll catch you in the next one.